The Dagbrek Special Educational Facility is home to children with various disabilities and the need for special education. And since this facility receives hardly any financial assistance from government, it depends on the assistance either in goods, finance or in kind to fulfill its obligations towards educating children who need that extra care and education. Bluefin saw the need to roll up their sleeves and got into the labour of love mode and repaint the walls in front of the school, while the second group opted to put in paving at the main entrance so that visitors at least can enter the premises on well-rounded off driveway. When I got opportunity to hold a conference in, in Namibia, where I'm situated at, um, I was looking around for projects. And Dagbrek uh, stood out quite clear in, in, in the sense that uh, the, the project makes a lot of effort in finding ways to be creative and to, to generate their own funding. And that kind of you know, was important to me, the way they operate and what they do to, to become self-sustainable. Group Chief Executive Johan Meijering is not office-bound like so many others in his position. He was part and parcel of the group whose aim it is to improve the environment so children at Dagbrek has no reason to be felt left behind. Blue Financial Services is a pan-African financial services group and we run a variety of different financial services company across Africa. We operate in 12 countries uh, all over Africa from running banking operations in Nigeria to insurance operations in Zambia and of course the financial services company in Namibia. The school is home to about 100 children, of which some are day learners, while hostel facilities at the school accommodate those who are from other towns. The learners at the end of the day, together with their Bluefin partners, worked out the slogan for the school. It's time to shine.